Everyone, we're playing against a pretty common mastery counter, which is Kha'Zix here, and we're going to be running a shield bow build, because I've been running a lot of shield bow lately, enjoying it. Honestly, the defensive stats on shield bow are always really nice to have, and uh, when you're playing against bursty characters, not dying in one hit is nice. Kind of like a good alternative to Sunfire Cape. We're going to go ahead and do this clear. Mm, that's a good double strike. That's what I like to see. We got Sejuani and Scion in the top lane here. These guys are duking it out in the bot lane. Honestly, I'm a little tired of seeing Zerath. We got two of these people in the mid lane, Katarina. Now the question is, is that Katarina gonna get super fed against the Lux? No mobility Lux. Will she get fed? We will see. Looks like they're pushing some Jinx rockets. Gonna do these Raptors. Oh, I hit the wrong one. Okay, <laughs> yeah, so I'm kind of clearing these Raptors a little bit differently than I should be. Kha'Zix has 8 CS, which means that he did Raptors? Oh, no, he did Wolves. He did Wolves. I'm dumb. He did Wolves, Blue, Red, and now he's doing Gromp, which means his Raptors are still up. If those are something that I want to invade on a little bit later. Something to keep in mind. But I have a feeling he's not going to invade top lane, or sorry, go for top lane, which means that he probably will pass back to his Raptors. So you want to make sure you're full HP for that. I'm going to go ahead and uh, use my potion. Yeah, he's coming around over there. I'm a little bit worried about that. Did he go towards bot? I actually was not paying attention because I had to do these. Yeah, this is actually kind of a worrying situation here, and this could make or break my game. I got meditate. Went bot, yes. I mean, I feel like my bot lane should have played way more passively off of that. Uh, uh. Got her. <laughs> yeah. The moment I saw them line up on that, I was like, this is gonna be a good one. I appreciate I appreciate all your efforts. Oh, there's a Katarina coming up behind us. So, yes, the answer is Katarina will get fed. Yes. All right, I'm going to utilize the Ward Trinket bug. Uh, basically, you switch from yellow to red and then back to yellow, and you can hold up the three wards. I do that when I hold on to them. Um, it's not the end of the world that the Katarina got fed because we can always uh, pivot into a wit's end. Eventually, so I might like grab blade and rune king after shield bow. I like to get gunzus But because I want to make some room for a wits end in the build if I go for gunzus I need to go for blade and rune king, which means wits ends a little bit later So we might just go ahead and grab the blade and rune king and pick up a wits end after and then a gunzus later Or we could even go for the goon or the wits end instead of the blade and rune king I mean it really depends on how fed Katarina gets if she continues to get fed, like let's say she gets seven kills, right? Then yeah, we'll consider the wits end. And we'll be buying the components of wits end and blade and rune king so that we can easily pivot if Katarina continues to get fed. But I do think she will get continue to get fed, so. <clears throat> Just doing a little standard clear for right now. All of our camps are spawning, so. You don't want to waste any more time than you need to. Let's go over here. Boom. Okay, Gromp is taken. Since we have no camps, no crab, no real good ganks right now, I am considering the dragon. We could put down the pink in the dragon. I don't think it's necessary. Well, now we have a potential gank bot, but actually they're kind of high on health. Like, they're, they're too high on health for me to go alone. What's that Highlander? This also means I no longer have prior on dragon. My how that has changed. And you can see that my ward is sitting at 100 seconds because of the bug. Uh, securing the dragon the best that we can. It's really unfortunate. Man, I hate Ash support. <laughs> I just realized we had an Ash support. That uh, that hero, in my opinion, is kind of bad. A lot of people disagree, but I actually think Ash is pretty bad. Uh, 
Ash, please. Oh, come on now. Come on, you got this. Flash for it. Oh, no. Well, it could have been a lot worse. Since we have enough for the Recur Bow, I'm going to grab that. We're going to sit on the Noon Quiver because the Noon Quiver is basically giving us a faster clear, which is 100% worth it. And the Shield Bow doesn't do that much early on anyway compared to Kraken, right? So I think it's actually okay if you're going to go Shield Bow to sit on the Shield Bow for a little bit or the, you know, the, uh, the Noon Quiver and then grab it afterwards. So in this case, we could actually probably go Blade of Rune King Wits End. Into new or into the shield bow or blade ranking into shield bow because the shield's kind of weak early, and that's really what you're finishing it for is for that shield. But we really need damage to clear fast, and the noon quiver gives us damage by itself to the, the minions. Um, I guess I'm down to go for the scion. I got seven seconds on this. I mean, the key is how fed is he? He's level seven, he wasted his stun. Yeah, I mean. He might come around here. I'm just going to wait a sec. Yeah, this is a rough time. I'm going to Blast Plant into the Rift Herald. No, I'm not. They just swept me. We know Katarina's coming. Right. And I'm going to pivot over to Scion again if he comes up through here. It's kind of annoying. He keeps disappearing and Sidrani doesn't have any prio on this. Throw your ulti. All right, that went well. I'm uh, pretty happy with the result of that, but Katarina's AFK again. I don't know where she went, actually. This is uh, trouble. This is trouble, potential trouble. I'm going for it. All right, back to work we go. No fear, no fear from the uh, fed Katarina. Absolutely no fear. All right, we managed to pick up the Rift Herald, and that's what I'm saying. She's fed, but now I'm fed too. Same CS, same kills. And, uh, you know, we just picked up a uh, a Rift Herald here, so I'm pretty happy with that. Mm -hmm. I think we can just continue to clear upwards. Actually, what we'll do is we'll grab this camp, go back, and bite a Blade of Ranking. Huge power spike, right? Probably one of the best power spikes in the game. So we got it, we back using Rift Herald, and now we can pretty much kill any lane we want. I mean, Kha'Zix might be an issue, but eh, it is what it is. All right, we're starting on these Raptors, and then I'm gonna make my way towards top of Rift. I think that is the best way to get my power spike. We see Kha'Zix in the bot side here. Mm. I mean, Scion's looking pretty tasty. He, ah, uh, I'm going to slap the Rift Herald a little bit further back. Yeah, I'm not really sure what Katarina was trying to do here. She's getting a little cocky with her lead. And it's really, it's just not paying off for her. Like she uh, needs to play more passively, in my opinion. We got ourselves a nice little Shelly push. Oh. Oh, no, he had flash up. <laughs> it's rough. Okay, so it actually looks like Ash is starting to troll a little bit. She's just kind of following around the mid laner. I don't know why. Um, I think the game's winnable. But I told you, like, Ash players are not real human beings, so. <laughs> it is what it is. He's going to follow Lux around. I have chat disabled, so I actually don't know what the discussion's even about. And I recommend that you just always have chat disabled. It's, uh, it's a terrible. Chat is terrible for... Uh, for keeping your mental sane here, dude. Alright, I gotta make my way towards top. Honestly, as long as Ash isn't messing with me, I don't care. I can still carry this. I think that, um... 
I think I'm our win condition here, and I think it's totally possible for me to carry even with somebody trolling. He's just walking around. I mean, as long as Lex keeps playing, it's winnable. Mm. Looks like Lux is just AFK now. And Ash is AFK with him. Some good stuff. Some good stuff. Alright, I'm coming to help mid. <clears throat> kind of sucks that we're players down. But, I mean, what can you really do about it, right? Oh, my thing almost came up. Lux teleporting. Ash can't follow teleport. Ooh, that was really close. Uh, I mean, the game's still winnable. I'm going to grab me a shield bow now. Okay, it is time to grab the components for Wit's End. Um, might even consider a death dance. Lux and Ash doing their thing. I'm still doing well enough. I think it's winnable. I'd be down to give Lux blue just to kind of make his mood a little bit better. Though, if I give it to Lux, Ash is going to try to steal it. So, maybe not the best idea. I'm going to deny that surrender vote. Like, I still feel like I have a chance of winning this. I'm just saying. We're going to lose Rift, but I don't think it's a huge deal. Because we want the enemy to all group on the Rift Herald. Mm -hmm. And they're still doing the little dance here. Yeah, you know, ever since I became a League streamer slash YouTuber, guys, I felt like uh, I changed positions from being a teacher to being a babysitter. That's sort of how it feels. Because <laughs> literally when you're playing League, you're just you're babysitting. All right. Well, we got this. Uh, we got this done. We're still five kills down. They got Rift. I have a feeling they're going to go for Sejuani. I need to be in position for this. But they didn't pass the ward. So we can just afford to sit here. Until somebody passes a ward. Actually, they could have passed through here. That's not a very good ward, is it? <laughs> not a very good ward at all. But, um, yeah, they're probably going to get Dragon. I'm not going to be able to contest it. And, um... I gotta back and head over to Dragon here and start beginning to work on our wits end. I'll get the movement uh I'll get the movement speed component first. I want the movement speed. It'd be nice if Lux can use the circular dragon. Looks like Ash has finally stopped chasing Lux around. Wow, that Rift Herald took a bunch of damage. Can you um use the sweeper on the dragon here? Okay, yo yo, this is nice. Lux is nowhere to be seen, but I'll take it. Oh god, she missed it all. Oh my god, I didn't. I thought I managed to get out of it, but I didn't. So Drani can come up the backside. <gasps> Jinx is going hard, dude. Jinx is going hard. I mean, he's going hard for the wrong dude, but he's going hard. Ooh, he got the kill. Okay, secured. Only me and Lux died. That's actually pretty good. They can actually secure the dragon off of that. Okay, this random vote's coming out again. No surprise, I'm going to vote no. Um, I mean, hopefully Lux is just leashing for me and not trying to steal it, right? I feel like she was trying to steal it. I don't know why she's, like, being mean to me. I'm not Ash, right? Like... I'm not Ash, <laughs> right? Like, why are you taking out your hatred on Ash on me? I don't know. We'll never know. But, um, yeah. We're going to continue to uh, do our farm. We almost got enough for Wit's End here. I'm getting really close, actually. 
And once I get wits in, this should be pretty pretty clean fights for us, I think. Mm. Yeah, once we finish this full clear, we get the wits in, which makes us really big. And then we can work on grabbing a death dance or something. Mm -hmm. I think death dance will be pretty huge in these fights. Like, it helps a lot with the burst from Katarina, helps with, like, MF ults, and, of course, Kha'Zix. But uh, I do need some sort of armor. We also need to get Gunzus, too. Like, there's a lot of different options here. Gunzus would be really nice. The thing is, is, like, Witten kind of replaced Gunzus, but we still need to be tanky in these fights, but we need to do damage. And typically, I like to buy damage before I buy tankiness. So, like, in that case, Gunzus would typically be better, but um, it's also cheaper. It's, like, 700 gold cheaper. You can get a Gunzus plus two long swords. Their entire team is missing. I have no idea where they are. Okay, there's a map. Uh, we see Katarina in the bot lane. I can go uh, try and counter that. We need a ward on Baron now. A Baron would be fantastic. I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna try to take out Katarina. Okay, not bad, not bad. I mean, Sidrani did a good job of holding them back. I think we just full push us here. My team's holding them off. Um, Scion's engaging. I think I back. I just back and help them, I think. Actually, I keep going. Sidrani's backing. She has TP. By the time I get there, they'll all be gone. Um, I think Lux is dead to what? Oh, Kha'Zix, I guess. Didn't even notice. I just want to keep pushing as much as I can here. I'm going to get us uh, 600 gold for this, by the way. It's huge. Huge amount of money from killing these side towers. Looks like they're kind of heading towards Baron. I mean, as long as we have a ward, it'll be good. I can path into here. I don't think this is warded. Ooh, it was warded. It's not warded anymore. We're just going to wait around for Katarina. She should be pathing up into here. I'm going to wait. I'm waiting kind of patiently because I think Katarina will come through here. Or I'll be able to pick up a kill on like MF or something. Alright, yeah, you guys want to go for Baron? I mean, I'd be 100% down for Baron here. I gotta, I gotta use Meditate. Right, that is a Baron for sure. Can we get this, this like, surrender button? Out of my face. <laughs> I can't keep popping it up. It's so annoying. Okay, I do not have smite, so good luck. We're gonna have to pull this in from MF, which isn't that big of a deal. And then we got a dragon to worry about. Old Zerath can ulti this. Hit it. Hit it, bro. Hit it. Get out of here! We gotta go! Okay, so we did manage to pick that up. I think what I want to get next is some armor-ish. Actually, I kind of feel like mercs are better here. Um, just for like, I don't know if they actually work against Scion because of how his stuns are. Like, they're kind of like knockups. But it works against Zerath. It lowers the damage of Katarina. Uh, lowers the damage of, you know, Zerath as well. Dude, this Sejuani is a beast. Look at him. <laughs> I love it. Oh, that's that's the thrill that you get from playing Master Yi. All right, beautiful. 
Now we gotta go uh, collect some stuff for our Gunzu's Rage Blade. Now, a lot of people think that Gunzu's is only good if you have crit, but actually Gunzu's is really great on you, even if you have zero crit items. Like, he is one of the best users of the unhit effects from Gunzu's Rage Blade ever. Uh, let's see, what do we got here? I'm gonna continue to push. I mean, they got red. I'm glad, um, you know, Ash and Lux put their differences beside them. That was uh, really neat of them. You know, they could behave like adults. You know, thumbs up to them for that one. We're going to go back and grab ourselves the first Gunju's component, which is some crit. And then since I'm basically full build anyway, I'm going to get me a Wrath Potion. Because, like, once we finish the Gunzus, we're basically full build. And I'm going to be out here without finishing the Gunzus. So, like, a Wrath Potion will be really great to help me secure the next team fight. It'll be pretty important to, you know, have as much of my build as possible. Uh, I kind of want to push bot, to be honest. But, like, if I push bot, my team's going to be in trouble without me. So we want to push mid here. Okay, they're all top. We're just going to push mid. I have a feeling Lux is going to die. Dude, they're still full HP, both of them. Okay, well, you know. My, my whole team's running up there, and I'm just like, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna get this tower. A little bit more gold. 750, so I guess 400, 350 gold from killing mid tower. It's about half the gold of a, uh, half the gold of a side tower here. I'm just gonna do my push. Man, I do a lot of damage to this tower, actually. It's kind of crazy how much damage I'm doing. Where is the enemy team at? I have a feeling, oh, their backs got canceled. Unlucky. <laughs> I'm just running around. Hey, you remember when uh, Katarina got fed and I was a little scared? Oh, yeah. Scared no more. Does she have a Zanya? She does. She has to go in. If she doesn't go in, right? We just win the game. I don't know what she was. She didn't even use her stopwatch. Poor Katarina. Imagine getting that fed early and then just getting curb stomped by a Master Yi. That's how you do it right there. That's how I deal with Katarina. If you want to see some more games where I build like Witsen, try out this game right here. I'll show you a little bit more the intricacies of building a Witsen. Great item. Super cost efficient.